Happy to be here. It's a beautiful day to play. Nice, cool weather. Yeah, it's about 60 degrees, overcast, no real wind to speak of. Yeah, none whatsoever. You know, no no, hot, no harsh sun, nothing. It's just quite comfortable if you're playing, that's for sure. A little yeah. chilly in the stands here, but nice. So tonight we've got uh, Malden Catholic uh, that we'll be competing with as they head out onto the field and Belmont gets ready to get out onto the field. Belmont is probably favored in this game, I would say. I would uh, say quite heavily. All right, so full disclosure, it's my alma mater, Malden Catholic. A lot has changed since I've been there. <laughs> It's an all-boys school when I was there. There's still an all-boys school, but there's now a girls' school. I'm filling in a need, I guess, in the North Shore of, uh, of Boston for that type of a Catholic education. But either way, um, it's interesting to see Belmont scheduling Malden Catholic given the size of the school. Yeah. You've got a Division One, you know, Division One team like Belmont playing likely like a Division Four type of club. So I think, if anything, this is a really great test for the Malden Catholic crew. And I think this is one of those kind of games where our Belmont probably should try to find its rhythm early and try to let me play out some kinks that, that have been, you know, presenting itself the last few yeah. games, especially playing the ball out of the back, um, not very cleanly, you know, just just trying to maybe if they can work this is give them an opportunity to work on those kind of things and refine them because they do have a tough couple of games coming up on the schedule. So yeah. hopefully they'll find their way out of these little little mishaps that have been happening, especially the last two games. Yeah, I'd like to see them uh, establish uh, a lot of possession. I'd like to see a lot of crisp passing and moving it through uh, up and down the field rather than resorting to uh, punting to random people. And it looks like we're about ready to, to go off. Refs are just checking the corners. And we are ready to go. Off we go. Okay, Malden Catholic kicking off. Playing it back deep. Looks like they want to bang it around a little bit early. So, keeping, keeping, trying to keep some possession. Looks like they're playing a four. Very similar. Four. That, that four, yeah. two, three, one, yeah. similar to what we've, what we've been playing all season. It looks the same exact, same exact type of lineup. It's right. taken by Santos, deep in the corner. And it looks like it's an MC throw. Quick, Quick throw. throwing. And cleared by MC. Play back to Cable. To Glavin, back to Cable. Wide to Lair. So are you showing and then moving on? Intercepted by MC, out of bounds. Belmont throw. Each side seems to be warming up quite a bit right now. <laughs> Yeah. I wouldn't say there's a tremendous amount of urgency uh, ongoing. Ashley Waters, a nice chip on. Sarah Yu, quick takedown, well defended by MC. This is one of those rare, you know, Saturday afternoon games you don't see exactly. that many of. So quick. So wouldn't, wouldn't surprise me if the girls are a little slow out of the gate. Played in by Taylor. Taylor. A little bit of a like they're playing the advantage on that. A little bit of a, a little bit of contact. Not sure if I mean I, I guess you could you would call that early in the game. Maybe just make sure the kids are uh, being safe. Looked like a little bit of incidental contact, but yeah, I would agree with that. So free kick, free kick for Cabral here. MC's um, actually dropping. I would expect him to be at the 18. The dropping back probably at the penalty spot right now, as far as distance goes. Yeah. Not giving the goalie a lot of space to come up and collect the ball. They must have a lot of confidence in the goalie coming off the line. There's in. Oof. Into what's coming out? Front. They clear it out. Lair plays it in. Cleared by MC. Look back from Cabral. Oh, top. Oh, looks like a little speed here. A little bit of a race going on. Well, well played by Cabral to Lair. Nice little back heel move. Into Lucy Hines. That's the pass I want to see. And Quick would, one touches and, and down I, in the corner. Looks like she's offside, yeah, and she there is. it is. Yeah. Yeah. Sapien was at least two, three steps offside. So referee had that whistle yeah. to mouth before the ball was even <laughs> kicked. <laughs> it's like he knew it was going to her. Again, if. Uh,
All right, and here's the kick from Molden Catholic. Up, oh, there you go. Dana Lair steps. Hines and Hines is contesting the ball here. Looks like it's found his way to an MC player. Played up and over. A little bit of a hesitation from Cable here. A little bit now. A little bit of playing move. Yeah, a little, dangerous, little dangerous bit of pressure pass back there. to the goalie. Yeah, and we should note that it's. Uh, Vicky Karaoke playing goal today. Again. Careball to you. Into Lucy Hines. Back up to you. Yeah, again, okay, well, watch the, the offsides. Watch again, the offsides. Off, again, offsides. Offsides. Offsides, both of them. And the, uh, I think if I think Coach Jemmy's gonna say quicker. I think that's what you're gonna yep. hear from here. I think, you know, that one two hesitation, I think he's looking for not even a one-two there, almost like a first-time touch downfield. Yeah. Well, Josepian was offsides even if Sarah Yu had been onsides. Agreed. Uh, Agreed. So really it's a little bit of discipline. And but if Josepian chose not to play the ball and, and yeah, Yu was running fine. from an onside position and Yu gets the ball, that's a non-call that's a non, non -call there. So Good point. So let's see what we have. So MC plays it downfield. I think he's out to get it here at the top of the 18. So she she plays it with her foot. Plays with her feet out wide to Taylor. Taylor just plays it downfield. Seppi in, pressuring, and well played by MC. That falls to Santos. Santos in to Seppi in once again offsides. Yeah. <clears throat> She's got to so. be a little bit more, a little more aware of where she is. <laughs> Coach reminded her to learn the offsides rule, I think, right from there. Um, but I like that pressuring, at sure. least uh, on the offensive side, to get there. Um. I think early in this game here, I think, again, we're seeing a little slow out of the back. You'd yep. like to see quicker, a little crisper passes. They still have a lot of room in the middle here. As Ashley Waters, all the, all the space in the world off to Sarah Yu. Yeah. Sarah just... I don't think she was anticipating it uh, going on that side. Yep. I think she was thinking that was going to stay wide. And, but either uh, way, it's the right idea. Taking it, it across the middle, bringing it back wide, changing mm -hmm. the, the, the location of the attack. If if, MC, if um, Belmont continues to kind of press it down the sides and kind of telegraph that pressing down the sides, yep. MC is going to figure that out pretty quickly. Yep. And again, do what everybody else has been doing, pressuring. Use the sideline as a defender. and yep. That's over the top. Sepian chasing. Shielded. Back to the goalie. Ooh, there that it is. That was a little close. That was a lot close. That's a great play, though. Dana Lair puts it into the corner, shield it out. See if we can't maintain a little pressure here. There we go. Played out by MC. Cleared, out of bounds, Belmont throw. Oh, we got ball girls this, uh, this afternoon. It's always helpful. Very helpful. Young lady There's from a beautiful soccer. little play. There you go. And was, uh, Lucy Hines, a beautiful Lucy little turn there. That was a beautiful pass. To Ramadas, her head is up. She was looking for that quick pass early and saw that it wasn't there. So smart play by her. To Waters, Waters, quick first touch to space. Well defended by MC. MC gets, trying there to get a little bit of rhythm here. Glavin out to play it. Up quickly to Santos. Santos quickly turns. She has the inside pass here. And it pays into nice Waters. Roll. And Waters up and over to Hines. There's the ball. That's beautiful. So it looks like Santos is going to run onto it, and Hines left off it. Hines, everybody going to goal, though. This and, is great. And uh. great job of the goalie there coming off the line, smothering that ball. I, I, I think when it's all said and done, I think the play is, and what the Coach Shemmy would like to say, is really a, a an, an angular run yeah. towards the goal. They were pretty flat in the run, but he'd also see, like to see that pass back away from the goalie, back to like the penalty spot or the, or the uh, well, yeah. towards the top of the penalty area. Sarah, you driving into the corner, crossing. Oh, it's ball. there. Oh, oh fantastic opportunity. The ball's still alive, though. Yep. To Santos, Santos up to Taylor. Taylor steps Taylor, in. I'd like to see her take a shot. Oh. Yeah, that's out of bounds, and it looks like it's a Malden Catholic. Cool. Yeah, okay. they're giving a Actually, corner. they're giving a corner. Interesting corner given. I 
it makes you wonder because the goalie let it go. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It was a, a deflection, the goalie let it go. The goalie let it go, so I'm saying. So at kind yeah. of usually when the goalie's marking for the ball, you know it's... Taylor had her hand up. I mean, it was pretty clearly indicating that it had been uh, deflected. But anyway. Played nice out by MC and head outside. Kind of to you, so look, hey, MC's pulling out. And he's, yep, pulling off. And it comes down across the middle. Played mm -hmm. wide. Goal kick. Looked like a chunk MC. of Belmont would have been offsides if yep. they had uh, touched that to begin with. I look good discipline from MC. They they were yeah. they were well coached there. They ball came in. They got out. Once that ball came out of the area, they got out. And they're they're seeing that they're seeing that Belmont's pressing high. Yeah. You know what? Right. They'll play the offside all day long, and they've been successful three or four offside calls alone this early in the first half. But play time. There's what I want Santos. to see. We've got to start winning, uh, being first to the ball. Play right across the middle. MC clears. Quick throw by Taylor. Santos using, using her body well. Well defended, though, too. Taylor with the throw. And Hines. Hines tries to run up and over, so to speak, to Hosepian. Brings it down, looking to turn, looking for a little love. Oof. No help there. Right. And there's a trip. At pretty much about 24, 25 yards out. Yeah. So here's an opportunity for Cable. I think she can put this on net. You're definitely shooting from here. Yeah. There's no reason why you wouldn't. Again, I'm just noticing how far back MC's playing this. Uh, I'm surprised they're not pushing it a little bit further up. But they're marking well, and, and that's over is, the top. It's up yeah. and over. That wall seemed further than 10 yards to me, too. So interesting. <laughs> Goal kick. All right, looks like uh, MC's taking a timeout. Taking an early timeout here. It's uh, just really 10 into the game. So, so far I would say Belmont seems to be playing at 60% uh, speed. It appears so. Um, Could be a lot crisper. A little bit crisper, a little more energy. I hate to say that we're a trap game, maybe, yeah, you know? Exactly. And maybe they're playing a nervous and just kind of afraid to make some mistakes. Like I said, they didn't finish the last game very well. Yeah. Actually, the last two games, the second half, they haven't finished very well. Um, maybe they're, you know, maybe a little hungover from that, so to speak, and carrying that into this game. Potentially. Potentially. Um, Potentially. Again, I'm, I'm so far impressed with MC's, you know, play early into this game. Well, no. they're, they're playing composed. They don't look nervous. Not at all. Uh, they're passing well. Their back line looks to be pretty organized and disciplined. And, you know, for me, what I want to see is I want to see Belmont start winning those 50-50 balls in the middle of the field for this game. To me, that would be a, a nice step in progress. I think that's where we start to, where it starts to break down. And I'll take that a step further. Not only do I want to see them, you know, winning those balls, I want to see them win those balls and actually do something with it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I want them to actually come up with a really quick, crisp pass. Yeah. Quick, through, through, angular pass between the defenders, not bringing it down, yep. meandering around, looking for looking for something that's not there. Yep. I just want to see a quick takedown, quick transition, and quick attack. Again, we've got wonderful, we've got wonderful speed on this team. You yep. know, and you've got a lot of speed in that bench, too. Yep. So there's things that they should be taking great advantage of, but yep. some hesitancy really takes that takes the speed out of their game. Yep, we have a, a, a slow lane sometimes that occurs in the middle of the field in that transition. 100%. I mean, there's reasons why your forwards are yep. you're getting called for offsides because they're making the runs earlier and they're anticipating a pass and it's just not getting there in a timely manner. Meanwhile, right. the defense is seeing that you're trying to play that through, so they're going to step up. So it needs to be quicker. It needs to be quicker all through the middle. It needs to be quicker on the outside. Throw in MC. Well taken, well turned, but it, but taken over by Waters. Yeah. Out of bounds, another MC throw. Okay, want to look for easy passes here. There's lots of open players, although everybody seems to be crowded into a uh, three yeah. square meter place. Yeah, yeah, it's a little bit of a mess in there. <laughs> Everyone's kind of, it's, again, it's great if you're, you know, again, it's great for MC to kind of slow, slow Belmont down. It's Absolutely. a great way to do things. But again, looks like MC's kind of, Okay, just play it back. Has, has no problem playing small ball. So there's a nice circle. Work around the back. Out to Sadie Taylor. Kind of a flat pass. I don't love that. Juan well, DeSantos looking to turn. Well defended. 
And There's the break. Three. There's the break. All right, stay and there's on. The speed. Now, stay see, on, now, stay now, stay on, stay with an angular run there. Yep. And um, uh, a little bit too much. Let's give it a rip. Let's see what she can do there. Oh, and she okay. scores. There it is. Beautiful trail. You know, the ball, you know, the MC defense collapses on yep. Santos. Three, yep. four players on her. Yep. Create enough, you know, create enough issue there that they were able to clear the ball, but not quite. And being all those players concentrated in one area just gave Lily, you know, Lucy Hines the opportunity to step in, bring that ball down, and actually had time to shoot it into the upper corner of the net. Wonderful, wonderful start to the, for, for uh, Belmont here. Yep. one nothing. And Lucy Hines was exactly where she was supposed to be on that play, right? 100%. On midfield, trailing, not getting too high. All right, see if MC can respond. Out of bounds for a Belmont throw in front of their own bench. There you go, I love that right there. Let's see if we can switch the sides. They do, right? Come up to Ramadas. Ramadas has two passes there. Qu needs to be a little quicker. Played downfield, defended by MC. Sorry, you has it. Nice play by Dana Lair. And she was trying for the feed through, but there. <laughs> Once again, Lily was a, probably two step or two offsides there. Yep. But there's, there's, the, there's the there's angular there's through ball, yep. and there's using Santo, Santos' speed. Again, Nobody so, helped with her, though. To look Again, look where the players are putting themselves, at the, at the penalty spot and at the top of the 18. Yep. So that's exactly where they're supposed to be. That's where Coach Jimmy wants to see them. And a Santos. Santos needs a little help here. She's surrounded by three. Yep. Cleared by MC. Just, MC's probably looking to hold here. I know they decide to play it upward just to give their defense a bit of relief. <clears throat> I'd like to see Belmont pour on a little pressure here. Ramadas is back. Back quickly to Glavin. Glavin to Cable. To Lair. Lair, Lair decides to take it. And now, she's, there's now, the angle, now, the angular there pass go. and offside. Yeah, yep. She was, again, she needed to take it maybe, take get that earlier. pass a uh, second earlier. Second earlier. It's like, again, again <laughs> it's Coach Jemmy saying exactly that. Yeah. <coughs> you know, saying exactly you that. You had it, don't drive it right into the line. Uh, an extra step, extra touch. Ball skips through, Cabral receives, Dana Lair on D. Uh-oh. All the Catholic for the nice little through. Karyuki easily receives. Place with uh, her feet, decides no, to telegraph that. Lair, uh, telegraph that to the. And a little bit of stress. Uh, yeah. Lair gets it out of bounds. Sure. Yeah, he, he wants to. Yeah. yeah. I would think that it's okay to drop it to your feet and play with your feet, but again, it's give your defender, be quick. Yeah. It's give your defender be quick. a chance there. You nice to ball, Hines. a nice turn by Hines. Two turns, and uh, offsides. She's offsides by. Offside. by uh, Seppi did not find four or five steps yeah. offsides. <laughs> Again, she's expecting. She, yeah. she, she's a day of the races, you know. Okay, Ramadas uh, plays it quickly back to Glavin. Careful wide to Santos. Well, well distributed there. Again, collapsing on Santos. Three players there on end. Oh, Ramadas there's Ramadas the break. first touch. And she plays it through. And it is a beautiful. Oh! oh. oh. And here comes Sarah. Can she finish? No. So wide. That was a great pass. That was a fantastic that, pass. I was a little, little surprised we didn't get a foot on it, but it might have just been a, a foot out in front. And then I think there was some confusion on letting it for uh, stay wide for, for Sarah U. But when you have that shot, you got to take that. She had some time. She could have just brought it back, had some time, yep. you know. Um, again, it's easy for us to say up here, but <laughs> it's a lot easier for us it, to say yeah. up here. Ball yeah. cleared up by Skip MC. Through three Belmont players. Taylor back to Glavin. Glavin plays it upfield, finds its way somehow to Santos's foot. Santos uh, plays it wide. Now here's that angular pass right now. Sarius, right? there it is. There it is. Yeah, it's the pass you want. So now let's see how Belmont plays this. Now look at the look where Sarah, uh, look where Lucy Hines is. Look where the ball went. And, uh, and once again, that's exactly where Coach Jemmy would like to see that. Uh, yep. That cross. We would prefer to see probably something on the ground and quicker. So yep. make that that one touch a little bit easier. But either way, that was exactly what he'd like to see. Lucy Hines, Hines having a game. Yeah. 
all over the place there. Played out wide, Saryu. Gets a little bit of time here. Plays the waters quick, waters back. You know, so it looks Dana, like- Dana Lair, oh, uh, yeah. three, yeah. three feet offsides. And it looks like they're gonna let the yeah. ball play through to the goalie and not play the offsides. I love that switch though. That yep. Dana Lair took it up to the wing. I like that Saryu fell back on that. That's some great communication. I mean, uh, again, I think the person running, a little bit offsides, but. Often when you see that happening, that, that says a lot about your center backs. You get a lot of trust in your center backs to cover for you. Yeah. Too, you know, that you have no problem having attacking from your outside defenders. All right. You take Sarah. it to the corner. Well defended. There's the ball and there's the pass. And across oh, the goal wow. Off and whoop. That yeah. should be an MC goal kick, and it is. Yeah. I think the MC coach was commenting he would have rather seen the goalie pick that up. Yes. Um, that's my opinion, too. I think you, your punts sometimes go a little bit further than goal kicks, you know? You also have the the defense has an opportunity to, to set up. Everybody gets in position. If you can get a quick turnover, quick punt. Yep. Um, quick counterattack. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And it looks like MC is set up for the counter punch today. Tail throws in here to Waters. Well defended. MC plays it upfield. Glavin. Taken by MC. MC plays it through. Shield and, and now quick uh, quick roll. Quick roll. There you go. That's a nice play. A little bit faster, but now she has got two passes. She had waters and you. Yep. And Cabral was back covering that and providing some. Ah, uh, Sarah, you're showing her speed, taking it to the outside, crosses it. Oh! Well, first touch, a little rough, but looks like MC's gonna shutter it out of bounds. Yeah. It's a goal kick, Malden Catholic. I thought Lucy Hines might have been the, could have could have taken that. She might have been the little bit more open on that one, but either way, still. Either I'm, way, well defended. Yeah. You know? And I'm, I'm loving the the crosses at the, at the 18, or the, top of the box rather than driving it deep into the corner and trying to cycle it back. Okay, it looks like uh, Lucy Hines and Ashley Waters are taking a break. And is Goulding. And Zika. Elsa Kimberly. And looks like Danica Zika is coming in. Ramadas is also off. Let's see what we got here. Quick back to Lair. Lair to Cabral. It's Glav. Accepted by MC, played through. glavin has got two players. Come on, goalie, you gotta come get it. There you there go. You go. Oh. Uh, whistle here, kind of curious what that is. A little confused here. She wasn't out of the area. Is he? I don't know what the uh, yeah, what the call is there. It's one of either either he thought that a pass. either he thought that Glavin back and then, thought that Glavin passed it back maybe and if that's the case it would be a PK no it wouldn't it? well it would not it actually be an, an indirect and it is going to be an indirect yeah there it is there okay it is, so and that's a great shot oh yeah, wow. Was. yeah he must have thought that Glavin passed it up passed it back to the keeper the keeper picked it up. Okay, and quick you cannot do that, God, quick. I like this. Driving up I the like field. this. Get MC jogging up the field, and all of a sudden, here they are. They're defending yep. immediately. All right, and into Kimberly. Kimberly looking. Let's get this through. And there's it Golding. Is through. Go, 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 go. Break. And, and she and finishes the through the legs. <laughs> through the legs. I think Goulding was a bit surprised that ball made it through. She took it a bit wider than she should have. Yeah. Um, have either way, she there. finished. She'll take it. <laughs> you know. That's, uh, what, her third goal of the season? Third goal of the third season. Third goal of the season. Fanora. Fantastic, fantastic pass. Fantastic play again. MC Starts looking. in the back, quick through the midfield, and then a quick ball through. And MC was looking for an offsides in that. They're still having a little quick discussion with the ref about it. Yeah. And I think man, there might have been some hesitation from the Belmont side because they might have thought the same, but look, got to play the whistle, play it through. All right, MC's picking up the pace a little bit here. 
looking to respond after going down two nothing here. With 20 minutes left. Golding again. Golding holding it up. Protecting back to Lair. Lair. Cable. Ball's Cable. hopping over some uh, feet today. Yeah. Play it out one time by Karyuki. Karyuki, oh, there's a free ball right in the Finds middle. Finds a way to Santos. Glavin apply. Lair. This falls to you. Look at, once again. Everybody's off. Everybody's off right now. Yeah, everybody's off. <laughs> Having <laughs> a cup of coffee <laughs> exactly. in midfield. <laughs> Take your sweet old time. Yeah. You know? <coughs> again, let, let's let it roll through to the goalie. Goalie puts the punts it upfield. Yep. Play back to Zika. Zika trying to drop it off to Santos. Can she get it in she shield? She almost did. Almost did. It looks so like. What are they going to give on that? They're asking. Santos is asking for the corner kick, but. Um, they're going to give a corner, it looks they're like. They're going to give a corner. Looks like one of the dads, Gabe Harris, is over there playing ball boy. <laughs> it's Farrah Harris' dad over there. We've got to thank Gabe after the game for his, his contribution for today's efforts. Okay, here. So okay, let's see if they've got any. The, see if they're going to go play the trickery. No, nope, nope, they're right playing the it box. through. Playing it short. Oof. Oof. All right, they'll get another shot at this. I think they were trying for the for the near post on that, or if that was just a little bit of a mishit corner. I think it might have been a mishit because didn't even quite yeah. make it to the six yard box. So yeah. let's see here. So looks like Lair's playing the the short corner there, and there's the ball played in. Uh, I don't know if the intention there was to get it to Santos. I don't but, know. Uh, but, but MC clears either way. Yeah. Good turn by MC, playing it wide. Look at that one touch up upfield here. Cabral playing it wide. Nice job controlling that. Good job playing it, but again, MC steps in. A little bit too much distance between the defender and the uh, outside midfielder there. Asking a lot of that pass. Played by Kimberly. Kimberly now. plays right. it through. There you go. And that goalie is up a little, a little bit high, expecting yeah. it and yeah. waiting for it. All right, that's why your passes need to be more angular. Yep. Uh, right there and then. Now you really that, want to be at the four yards in from the corner of the box. Okay, so there she was offsides there. Yep. So in that case there, if Sepium was in an offsides position when the ball is played, yep. she steps in to play it, and when she, once she touched that ball, since she came from an offsides position, it is considered to be an offsides call. Being offsides actually gives her advantage Yes. to uh, play the ball. MC decides to play it short, pressured by Goulding. Goulding. Turnover. Turn, turns it over. Can she save it? Forces. She does. Takes it she wide. Drives. Well defended. A little bit long. She's going to get now shielded she just here. She needs to get in here. Uh, well defended by MC. It's Should okay. Be. You know, okay, so now they got a, MC's got a little bit more work to do coming out of the back. Yeah. Some subs for MC right now. I'd like to see uh, maybe coach, I mean, if you're, if you're a forward, you're sitting on the defensive line, starting your run parallel or perpendicular to where you want to go, get a little speed up, and then when the ball is played, you can cut up. Correct. Rather than kind of being flat-footed and, and standing still or going early. See, right now, here's it's played out wide to Lair. Look, Goulding's going wide for it. Uh, that was a little telegraphed there, but that's okay. Yeah. I mean, but smart Golding's play by Goulding. She's, she's waiting for it. She had time and space too. Played in Dosepian, played out by MC. Throw in here, Dana Lair. Tries to over the top. Tries to squeeze it in between there, but unlucky there. Goes to Hosepian. Hosepian's got Goulding open. Goulding takes first touch, goes and around she's here. And break, and now it's the... And tries to play around, continues to play it around. She's getting a little bit of... Little, uh... Little, 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 little tugging, little holding. Yeah. Ref right there. I think that was a good no call. Um, it's good defending. I think it's one yeah. of those things that she needs to learn to play through. Yeah. You know? Golding taking away the short pass, forcing them for the long kick. Yep, play downfield. To Lair, Lair just drops it in the middle. Seems to find its way. Nope, that's too well defended by MC. Okay, a little bit of standing around right now from Belmont. A little, a little yep. too casual up there. They should be owning these balls. Kevin way off the line. Way out of the line on that. That's okay. Uh, I don't have a problem with that at all. 
Blair up and over, and it is Goulding again. Goulding again, Poppy this time looking to make a pass, and she passes a far post to, oh. but a little bit too far. She was looking for Danica Zika there. Yeah, not sure Danica Zika knew that was coming. Yeah, Nora was quick to actually cross at that time. She didn't take that extra, that extra touch. Handball. Cable to take it. Okay, looks like they're all in the 18. Cable okay, plays it wide into Golding. Golding tries to take it down with a quick, hard, tough, tough first touch. Yep. Sepian just with a great effort right there. Actually, that might have been Elsa yeah, Kimberly. Elsa Kimberly. That was Elsa Sorry. Kimberly. Now it's funny. Elsa I was just looking. I'm saying, should that, should that have been Taylor's ball? Uh, as Taylor was running away from it, she actually might have had a better play at that than yeah. than uh, Kimberly. But Kimberly kind of came out of nowhere to win that ball. Falls to Santos. A little Santos bit of a trip little there, little. and she still comes up with it. Uh, play through to you. Uh, intercepted by MC center back. Does a nice job there, stepping hot, stepping in there with confidence. Still driving. And a one-two, one-two pass. Well played by Cabral. Yeah. Cabral, a little bit of touch. She's going to probably okay. try to play it downfield. And there, there it is. And there it is. If Golden can up Golden on can this, can she keep it in? No. Nope. Cannot keep it in. <coughs> ball girl quickly getting the ball in. Wonderful job. Looks like she's got some helpers now. She's not all by herself anymore. That's good. Which is a good thing. Looks Game like Gabe relief. Harris has been relieved nice of his duties ball. on the other side. <laughs> Ball nice through, through ball. Zika. And it oh. is an offsides call. You know, that was again, a little closer. That one's closer. I like that. It was a quick, nice, nice yeah. quick pass to a person who's trying to find her way back in, onto the field. Now, you know, she's coming off an injury. She's been slowly bringing her back, Zika. Yeah. I'm sure she's itching to, you know, to, to cash one in right now just to kind of get herself a little bit of confidence and a little bit of comfort out there. Played wide. Intercepted by MC, back to Taylor, actually. Falls back to MC. Back, back to Taylor. To Taylor. <laughs> a little back and forth here. And looks like it'll be a Belmont throw. Belmont throw. Little assistance from the ball girl. Ball played in. Well played by Kimberly, but nice well, even well, well defended. defended by yeah. MC, though. You know, I mean, there's yep. some, look for some really some positive things from MC here right now. Well played by Glavin. Okay, so Glavin's got some, looking for some help here, and she decides she's to play it through. Oh, extra touch. A little, yeah. bit, little bit hard, and that, that touch she's there. Still there, chops it over the top. DeSantos. Everybody's on. It appears so. Everyone's on. Let's see what happens. Santos, Santos fighting. As and always. A rip. And a rip. Well, and a shot. Well played by the, by the goalie. Brings it down. Collects it immediately. Quickly to the end line. Gets Come it downfield. Brought down by MC. Collected by Kimberly. Nice job Kimberly. using her body there on that turn. Santos, Santos, first touch into space. Turns, looking for Zika. Goalie, well defended again. Defend, defense doing a nice job. Just slowing yeah. down the, the speed from the top. Ball's played Oof. short. Kind of set her up like a bowling pin there. Yeah, she did. <laughs> you know, I mean, in rugby, that's called a hospital pass. <laughs> yes, it is. I, 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 don't, I don't know how she, did, how she didn't see Golding waiting yeah. for that. Yeah. Ball played into Golding. Turned in quickly. Played up, again, smothered kind of by the defender. Looks like it's an yeah, MC. Yeah. I'm sorry, sorry, Belmont throw. Belmont throw. Well played out by MC. Sorry, you. There, quick, quick reaction time from uh, MC, but honestly, even if that had gotten through, that might have been over the back line. Sorry, you coming off to a nice applause. Always, always great effort for her. Throw in. Nice play by Kimberly. Glavin cycles it wide. There's a nice through ball. Can she get there? Santos offsides oh. again. That was Elizabeth Schreiner that came in for Ilsario. 
That's why I think with the proximity of this referee to the MC bench. Yeah, he's going to be causing some issues. Yeah, I think he's going to be probably calling more, yeah. offsides, more offsides than not at this from this point going forward. Yeah, well, he's been getting a, a mouthful. Getting a mouthful from the MC coach. And if I was right. the MC coach, I'd be doing the same thing. Yeah. <coughs> All right, so here we go. Looks like the oh, ref is having a little conversation. Looks like they're not happy with one of the game balls. Must or are be they the case. just loading one back behind the goal? Ah, okay. That could be the case, too. And this. Okay, played by MC. It's Glavin, Glavin. Oh, nicely defended by MC. Showing some speed themselves. Out of bounds. Belmont throw. Taylor to take. Oh, no. MC throw. Yeah. Little ball guard bias there. Tossing right to a Belmont player. You know? <laughs> Love it. Well, that's, that's <laughs> Love what we, it. That's what we pay her for. Exactly. All right. Throw out the run, MC. Kimberly. Kimberly heads it off, an MC player. Finds its way back to Kimberly. Ooh, there's a penalty right there. Yeah. Yeah. Dangerous little play right uh, there. Yeah, Kimberly Nobody's bounced hurt, but, right off that yeah. and right back at as if nothing happened. Yeah. All right. Okay, but a play. Just over eight minutes left to go on the first. Two nothing Belmont. Goals by Hines and Goulding. Nice. Taylor heads it down to Santos. Yep. Dosepi, Dosepi needs a turn. Looking for now. Yeah, uh, oh, yeah. It has yeah. to be Goulding taking this ball. Yeah. Nobody else can take it. So Nora needs to take it in. He needs to cut in. Nice ball across the middle to the penalty spot. Oh, and, and a rip. Step in wide. Yep. That's what he wants to see. Yeah. If any other player touched that ball, it was an offsides. Yeah. So was... Goulding had to touch that ball. All right. Looks like we have a timeout for Belmont. Coach Jemmy perhaps wants to discuss the five yards offsides on a regular basis. <laughs> five. <laughs> yeah. Being generous with five. <laughs> <coughs> now, I think it's, if anything, he's seen a lot in they have the opportunities. I think he's yeah. just going to tell them, look, you just got to be precise. Yeah. You know, you see a lot of good things here. You guys are given the space. And meanwhile, you know what? They're giving you a bit of a game. So, so this, listen, you're, 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 you're probably where you should be in this game right now. Maybe one, maybe one more goal, maybe if that, but at this point, the matter is there's a lot more opportunities and this is the time where you can try to refine your game. <laughs> yeah. Like we said, pregame, this is, might be the type of team where you can look to find your, a little more rhythm out there. <coughs> look to find, look, 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 look for those things that you were lacking the last few games. Yeah. Get a little bit crisp on your passing. Be smarter. Be quicker. Well, I mean, they, they, we can see they're clearly working on their timing of uh, these runs for sure. These runs. Uh, but it's funny. It, the most effective runs and aren't coming when the ball's played up the sides. The balls come when the ball's cut through the middle. At an angle. At an angle. And yep. then kind of cutting across the field and then sliding it in between on the angles. That's where they're getting yep. the opportunities. So the last few games where we're seeing them trying to play it up the sides, up the sides from the back, it just when they're collapsing on the midfielders, obviously that's not working. Yep. So as they cut inward, they have an opportunity to cut inward and create that angled pass yep. and using their speed to their benefit, I think they're, they're going to they're gonna continue to see good results. <laughs> All right, so even, even Lena Marinell getting involved in the coaching here. <laughs> so, <laughs> giving Goulding an air fall about her runs. You know, looking for a little bit, probably more of an angle from Goulding as well. And it looks like Zeke is getting the same same advice from Coach Coach Jamie. All right, it's about seven and a half minutes left in this half. Scores two nothing, Belmont with two. MC nil, as the soccer terminology goes. You got to say nil. I did, I was, where I was, yeah. I was getting that into I was gonna start counting life. how many times you said the word nil today. <laughs> All right, into Kimberly, it's, Kimberly. It's, it's not nice. nil. It's not nil. Yeah. That's for sure. There, okay, play well out of there. Okay, Goulding. The happy feet there, looking to make the run. And a little, little forced there at the end. <coughs> it was actually, ironically, so that Nora was actually shot. It looks like she was coming back to take yeah. Dana's defensive spot at that point in time, thinking that she was going to make the run through. She could have. Yeah, at that she point, it looks like she, going. Yeah. 
There's definitely something, uh, as soon as a defensive player finds himself that far upfield, they start panicking about getting back. Yes. And that's normally when they launch it. Um, more play. often than not, oof. A little misplayed there, but Glavin's there to collect. Played up to Golding. Golding with the first touch, plays it forward, kind of tries to cut it in Cross. for Hasepian. That was not a bad idea. It's going back to goalie, though. Going Get back on to that. goalie. Yep. Hasepian, I don't think, was expecting that pass. That, nope. was, that was a nice idea. Well played by Golding. Bumped. Plays it wide. Anticipated Again, the Again, looking back. Nice play. Looking and now the cross. Oh, oh she's fall. kept your feet. Fall, <laughs> fall Nora. She's <laughs> kept your feet there. Exactly. Oh. Every other coach on earth would have been like, fall. Exactly. Glavin rips one from, from distance. the 35 yards out. Kind of one of those, is it a shot? Is it a pass? Is it a, it's towards the goal. Either way. But we're not sh quite sure how to define it. It's like that whole hockey terminology. Pucks on net. Got to get pucks on net. So Sorry. that's the same thing here. All right. So funny watching that from Goulding. I mean, <laughs> you can see the trip. It was there. Yep. It was legitimate. She plays through it. You know, it's so funny. You know, I, I, I kind of like it. I kind of like it. I There's nothing like worse than, uh, than the flop. So the flop, yeah. So that like, one oh, might have been had it. <laughs> <laughs> so two Belmont players collide and going for the ball there. I'd rather have that than no players going for the ball. True. Okay, and Azika plays back to Taylor. Taylor to the Which corner. Pop to fly into the corner. To Santos. And Santos. Santos like a, also another one trip. plays through a trip. And, and we got the corner. Like they're going to give a corner. They're going to give the corner. All right. You know, the, i got to be honest. The corners to, so far in this game have not been sharp. I'd like to see one in the box or... Or see if we can't get a, a decent opportunity on one of these. MC's done a great job in defending uh, in front of the goal. Actually, it was a free kick, not even a corner. Wow. Okay, so Santos coming. All right, so Santos comes out wide, takes a defender with it, clears a little bit of space. All right, so now she moves away. Defender stays with her. Dropped it's in. It's at the, at a the header for Glavin. Oh, no. Holding. Oh, orange the corner. All right, we'll try this on the other side. You've got Cable taking the kicks now with Sarah Yu uh, out. Got Galavin in the box, Cable taking the kick, and Taylor as the sole defender back. Okay, Coach Jimmy's jamming, jamming everything in, they're getting everybody in there, getting bodies in there. Right now there is a sole defender back like you mentioned. Oh, oh played short, short. Short to nothing. Yeah. All right, Santos comes with a big bump. All right, ref contemplating. Nothing really to contemplate there. That was a foul. No, <laughs> that was a foul. I was, 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 was worried if he was going to be pulling out a card. <laughs> that was uh, definitely a foul. So I was worried he was going to card that. Yeah. It's okay to bump shoulders, but, it's, but, but if, if you're playing the ball, but if there's no ball to play, yeah, there's no bumping. North, North oh, holding. Nice. Almost turns it over. And the MC plays the body ball Body beats the body coming through the rye. Yeah. All right. Okay, Lair with, with the throw. Into Kimberly. Kimberly turns to defend, to close the defense. Oof. Cable. A little. Plays up field. Okay, now we get a little bit sloppy. A lot of, a lot of uh, pushing and oh, grabbing. And yeah. Tough pass. Okay, now Not every single pass. player is stuck within 30 yards right now. Everyone's playing the... So right now, MC is pushing that line up further and further, if you've noticed. Just over three left here in the first. Quick play out of the back to Taylor. Takes it up the side. And it's a quick turnover. MC throw. Quick stop for MC. Okay, I got new player up top. It's a Belmont throw. Again, that's a coach's annoyance right there. <laughs> Play it into Santos, quickly turn over back to Glavin. Careful to Lair. Moving backwards and you got a man on. Uh, look at, all right, they're, nice they're pressuring, they're pressuring, and there's a through ball. Oh, well defended. 
Dropped to Golding. Golding. Yep. Uh, and Golding was offside. Yep. Uh, you know, she was looking for that first ball. Yep. And it gets, gets, she thinks that's getting <laughs> caught. All right. The ref is not on the line. The other line. And play downfield to Lair. Up and over to MC. She's going to let it go out of bounds for a throw. Dana Lair breaking on it. Alyssa Shrana defending. Back to Lair again. Co collecting, getting back. Lair's having a great game. Yes, she is. She's all over the place. Using her speed, being aggressive. Throwing quick. Kimberly. Back to Glavin. Oh, Glavin. Played it wide. Ball brought down by MC. Played, played wide. Again, MC's not, a play, not afraid to play through. a little small ball. Right? Gabriel. And just clears it out. Smart, safe play. Belmont resets the D. Brought down by Goulding. And there's a long, long shot. To Karayuki. Karayuki quickly okay. rolls it out to Taylor. Taylor now is a run. A hotly on the pursuit from MC. Brought back to Glavin. Glavin up and over sure. to Zika. And it's Zika defended. touches that. It's it defended by MC, brought out wide with Santos colli collapsing, colliding probably too. All right, they're giving it to a Belmont throw. Zika to take. Oh, did not clear the tall MC defender. Taylor with Taylor a cross, with right on. Oh. Right on a Sepian's foot, foot there. Yeah. yeah. Oh, she could only brought that down. I love that she play. She been sitting by all by herself. She didn't dump it in the corner. She took the opportunity to get a cross in. And quickly, too, for that matter. Yeah. Okay, played in quickly to Zika. Zika plays it back to Taylor. Same type of play. Uh, MC tries to clear. Fortunately for them, falls to one of their players. No, Kimberly. It's Kimberly's got the ball. Tries Rips to play it through. through. Nice. Santos. De Santos wide. Get to the back post. Santos looking for a little help. All oh, one, two. And still keeps her feet here. And there. Oh, they blow the whistle there. Interesting you timing. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> Interesting timing. <laughs> well, calls the halftime whistle right, right yeah. when. As somebody's about to score. It's uh, about to shoot. So yeah. that is halftime, folks. As right, so of right now, it's uh, two to nothing. Belmont over Malden Catholic. Goals by Hines and Goulding. And welcome back to the second half of Belmont Girls Varsity Soccer. Score is Belmont 2, Malden Catholic 0. Uh, looks like we've got some changes on the Belmont side. Yeah, it looks like we've got Farrah Harris joining the back line with Kaylin Swignani. Chloe Ellison. Chloe Ellison. Looks like the Caputo sisters are in as well. There's a oh, nice line, Malden Catholic. Got one, two, three, four, five on the back line. Yeah, they're, they're and again it's high. <laughs> they're, yep. they're they're trying. They're, they are playing the offsides. Let's call it what it is. And and Belmont has no problem being offsides right now these days. So <laughs> so they're playing right into it. Okay, his uh, Kimberly was forcing it downfield. Ball out of play. Quick Malden throw. MC throw. Yeah. Kimberly plays it to Zika. Zika so on the defensive it over. midfield side of things. Golding chasing. Oh, this is a dangerous play for Malden. Uh, and what's the call? Goal kick. Okay, so right now you've got Chloe Ellis and Nora Goulding in the middle. And you've got Danica Zika uh, playing that defensive midfield position with Elsa Kimberley, which is not a place we've seen Danica before. It would be interesting to watch this. I'd like to be yeah. curious to see how she handles that. Uh, well, obviously she has the skills, but... For sure. Yeah, it's a, and, and Goulding is probably going to be playing that um, holding midfield position or attacking midfield position in the Those center. Is yeah, that Ali Caputo? That's Ali, I believe, right? Uh, Ali, I four. Yep. I can't see my old and eyes all the way across the field. Ball out of play. Looks like it's an MC ball. Cabral playing it back to Harris. Harris goes Harris. back to the goalie, safe play, and now quick, nope, there you go, quick touch out wide again. It's Kalen Spaganani. Someone's got, needs to show, someone needs to get yep. a little bit of help. 
She's looking upfield. Looks like Santos is a little bit too far away for her. Yeah. Right. Kalen defending, but not defending. Plays the ball out of bounds. Throw All right, MC throw. Deep in Belmont territory. Played out by Santos, trying to get out, and she maintains possession here. But oof. Well defended by MC to Kimberly. Yep. Kimberly needs a needs a pass to Kaylin Spinani. Kaylin Lennart. plays it off the MC yep. defender. Upfield throw for Belmont. Okay, what it be? Quick throw to Zika. Zika turns. And there's, and there's her speed showing right there, playing and at the And there's the ball, Golding. Golding's got it. She's on her horse. Nora's on her horse. Breaking. Playing a looking. She's look, got look, Chloe look. Ellis in the middle, but uh, hold it, hold it, hold it, wait, wait. And she tried, there it oh. is. Oh! <laughs> Had Ali Caputo wide. Yeah. Oh, nice idea. Yeah. Nice idea. Not <clears> sure, <throat> sure whether she was off sides or not, but either way, she was looking for her. Nice yeah. pass by Nora. She, yeah. had, she, had a, she had an option for Zeke or two at the top of penalty area, but it looks like she had. That was a nice, nice opportunity there for a quick, just put your foot on in front of that and uh, bounce it back towards the goal. It came in with pace. Uh, could have been, well, could have been any, a nice goal. Played out wide to Kimberly. Kimberly out of bounds. MC throw. All right, yeah. oh, wide open. Wide open in the middle here, so. Yep. Golden trying to get back. That is, I believe, Jane Maybe. Caputo playing over to Elsa Kimberly. Again, quick turnover. Spagnati. Spagnati. To Farrah Harris. Farrah Harris. Maintains control, does a good job okay. using her body. Oof, careful One thing I've noticed about Farrah, Farrah as a player, she does actually make really good decisions. Yeah. You know, she's got good, she, got, she handles the ball well, but she makes really good decisions. And here comes Ali Caputo playing the right. She's got Chloe she's Ellis and Golden in the middle. Can she get there? And it was an offside call, it looks like. I believe, or did it roll hmm. out of bounds? Kind of hard to tell. Not sure who's making the, the call, actually. And it's offside. It's offside, it's okay. It's funny, the whistle came from the opposite side of the field. So it's an interesting... Interesting call being made from that distance. Yeah. All right, MC with the throw. Belmont's got actually, a... Actually, it's MC kick, actually. MC kick. Yeah. MC, Belmont's holding a line at 40. Played short. And now it comes in. Oh, no. Played out wide, back into the middle. One quick one, two. Played downfield into the corner. And out of play. You know, I like that. Uh, I like that play actually by MC. Uh, played it short, then ran up on it and received a, the give back, and then put it over. Um, this is one of those times kind of when you're starting to see a coach trying to instill a system. Yeah. He's trying. You know, he's trying to get players to play a certain way. Play quick. You get a kick. Play quick. quick. And they're one two, and they're moving. Yeah. And they're moving yeah. into the lanes to receive the passes. Yeah. So they're seen. They're, they seem to be pretty well coached. Yeah. You know, and um, and they seem to be playing the way the way they're being taught to play, which is a great sign for the coach. Ball played into the corner. All right, Cable, Cable defending, looking upfield to Zika. Zika's going go. one, two. Okay, Zika decides to turn and go herself. Plays it through. That's on. <clears throat> Plays it wide to Chloe Ellis. Chloe Ellis is, is pursuing it. Goalie clears it. MC brings it past midfield to Cable. Cable looks oh, one, two. All right. To Farrah Harris. Quick pass up, oh, intercepted. A nice, nice play by MC here. Way to attack. Elsa Kimberly, nice job tracking back to defend. MC contains, con, continues possession, excuse me. There you go. Santos comes back and wins. Well defended by MC. Ball up and over. Nor uh, Golding taking it. Golding takes the high line on that. And, and, and there it is. She stays with it. Yep. Stays with it. Uh, she's she's got two people on her. She, can she can she play it? Up oh, up. Nope, well nope. defended by MC. Yep. I would have liked to have seen to play it back to Santos, but looks like MC did it for her. Oh, oh and there, <laughs> there's a there's a little bump. little of a bump. 
probably a smart play on MC at that point. I think, uh, but it's funny. I'm laughing only because I'm sure she's taking harder bumps this game yeah. <laughs> than that one. So I'm laughing because it's that's the one that takes her down. Okay, All so right. able to take the kick. Hits. MC three uh, three person wall. About 24 uh, yards out. No, now a two person, and there's the shot. And there's Far the corner. It's in. Oh, oh well I thought played by the goalie. It's a nice that, shot. That had eyes. That ball had eyes. I was going to the upper corner. Well played by the MC goalie. It's a nice shot, though. Really yeah, great Cable, shot. Beautiful shot. She took it quickly, too. Yep. Okay, Jane Caputo defending up to her sister, Allie. Chips it on. Chips it on, keeps it in. Nope, nope. she does not, unfortunately. Out. Ball out of bounds, MC throw. Okay, we got Elizabeth. some subs. So Danica is coming off for Elizabeth Schreiner. Again, Danica slowly mm. trying to find her way back to playing form. Big smile on her face. Mm -hmm. MC also subbing. Number 13's done a nice job for them today. Yeah, she has. Schreiner defending. Okay, free kick. Free kick. I'm, I didn't see a lot there, but. No, nah, well, actually, free kick or, no, out of bounds, I guess, a throw in. Okay. He, look, he had his arm up like it was a three kick. Okay. There's the. Ball played downfield. Out of bounds. Belmont ball. Played up field. Ali Caputo. Cut nice him quickly. Curve. Yep. A little, little, little miscommunication there between Kimberly and Schreiner. Spagnati, I don't know. Schreiner uses her body well there, holds it up. Yep. For Jane Caputo. Yep. Yeah. Play ball There's played through. through, and here comes Chloe Here Ellis. comes the goalie. She's out. She's going to have to kick that. MC goalie does a nice job coming yep. out and getting that, making a good decision there. Plays it downfield, falls to an MC player. Ball out of bounds. Throw in Belmont. Like a put a nice turn. And that's all. That's Goulding. on. Is Goulding. Is Goulding. Able to get to it first. Oh, and there's a penalty. And they let it play through. Wow. That is he point. How does he not point to the spot on that? I don't know. I don't understand uh, that one. I have one. no idea how he's not You're pointing. Trying. That is obviously the goalie did not play the ball. I know he's not playing the spot on that. Are you saying that she played the ball? You know, and, uh, and I can understand letting the, letting the play go through in case Santos has an opportunity to put that away. Yeah. Is that but, Glavin going in up top? And, and moving, moving Gould into the outside. I'm laughing because Glavin's finding <laughs> a way back into the forward line. Yeah. And, and she this. breaks and at she, a shot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no one saw that coming, including us. You know, so. There you go. There you go. Who knew? Who knew? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe as a, as, a, as a center defender, she uh, can read and understand what's going to happen in the back line of the Malden Catholic. All right, they're going to go long on this one, I'm going to bet. I'm still trying to get my head around that non-call on the penalty. But anyway, yeah. played up by the uh, Shriner should take over to El, uh, Spagnati. Spagnati to Kimberly in the middle looking. Just being pursued just from behind. Nice, nice patience there, though. Trying to play as a ball. There's through. Glavin. No, and, she's and not Ellis and the yeah, MC yeah, goalie's it. there. Yep. Little, falls kind of awkwardly on top of that ball. A little bit. Quick throw out. Ball's out of play. All right, Belmont throw. The Caputo sisters hand the ball to each other. Ball played back. Gabriel. That's dangerous there. Yeah. Jane Caputo with the throw. To her sister Allie. MC steps in front. Gabriel. Schreiner. Oh, they're trying to feed Glavin. Glavin is, is taking um, some pointers from the Hosepian How to Be Offsides handbook. Exactly. You know? <laughs> Farris, nice play. Ball drops in. Cable oh. on the turned off. Cable turned over. Uh, oh, she but she wins it back. Love well. that effort. And the Shriner. Shriner, lots of space now. now oh, nice, nice play, one, two. Yep. Look at, look at, look at they're off to the, standing still at the, at the 50 waiting to run. Yep. Interesting. MC's, can that high, that line from MC gets higher and higher and <laughs> higher. <laughs> They're gonna be. Yeah. They're gonna be. You know. Obviously, you can't go. You, you can't go past, past midfield. 50, but yeah, <laughs> you can't go past like, midfield because you won't get an offside call. Yeah. Anything. Be, uh, you know, outside the 50. So, you know, so it's just Glavin. so funny that it's at the 50. 
Okay, so it looks like there was a uh, foul against MC. It looks like it's a free uh, kick for, for Belmont. Will Goldie yeah. take it quickly? Nope, that's looks like Carapel's gonna take it. You could Coach Jemmy uh, giving guidance to Hannah Glavin to get up, not play defense. Okay, flat line here from MC at the 20, over up the and over top. to the corner, and I think Golding's going to get, get there. Of course, you can you get that, hon. They get to it. Uh, played well defended by MC. Uh, throw. That ball fell nicely to her. Yeah, it did. It did. Looks like Kalen's making the long run down here to do the throw in. Spagnati. Throw into Glavin. Up. Oh, and there's the corner. There's All the right. corner. All right. See if Coach Jamie has any trickery here. Looks like he's just going to let him put it into the box. Go. Yeah. I, I just think it's, I'd like so. to. I'd, I'd like to see a ball be dropped right, <coughs> the, right the right the penalty spot. Yep. Played short. And up. Uh, yep. Okay, able to kick again. Looks like Belmont's got everybody in the box. Like to see everybody drift out a little bit, so they're moving towards the goal. There they are. There it is at the there front it post, is off the side. Off the side of the net. All right. So it looks like Elsa Kimberly's coming off for Olivia Mann. Olivia Mann oh, comes in. Affectionately known as Liv by the teammates. Looks like she's going to be a defensive midfield. MC with the kick. Played right, live early. Okay, here's MC transitioning up and over, and looks like Kariuki's gonna be patiently waiting for that ball to arrive to her. She's there at the top of the air to, to receive it. All right, quick decisions, quick decisions when you get that ball. Downfield, Tally Caputo, out of bounds. All right. MC throw. Ball played up. Caputo for the throw for Belmont. Into Schreiner. Ball played through to Kariuki there. Kariuki, quick so, roll. Okay, Oof, quick, dangerous, quick roll dangerous, dangerous, dangerous. I like the speed, but. Kalen quickly out to Goulding. Here we go. Goulding turning, looking upfield. Just using she your sees speed. a lot of green. Yeah. I think I'd like to have seen North pull off a pass there. Yep. Kalen to try to collect it. There's Harris trying to clear. Golding one time. Golding does over. over the top. Played and out of bounds by MC. Of... Spagnati with a throw. To Glavin. Up and over to Ellis. Ellis try, oh, almost gets away with it. Oh, Glavin. Glavin. Right Caputo. The Shriner, drops the Shriner. Shriner up and over for Caputo to the corner. Can she get there? And she can, and she, she does. Her. And she plays. She's played off an MC player who oh, does a nice job trying to keep it out from going out of bounds. Caputo forces the play. I gotta say, I'm, I'm pretty impressed with uh, MC ah, and how they play as a team and, and use their utilize their talent. They stay disciplined, they clearly no, I, I said I, I said earlier. I think they seem to be well coached. Yeah, I really do. They've uh, really still kind of keeping with their plan, and they haven't really deviated from it. And quite frankly, it's you know it's it seems to be working for them. You know, yeah. holding us to two goals right now is is for for a team that probably plays Division Four schedule. Yeah. you know, is um, is impressive. Okay, ball played short. Short for the big played downfield. To Kalen Spagnati. Played wide by MC. Kalen continues to pursue. Farrah Harris is there. A little bit of crowd. Nice play there over to Cabral. Cabral with mm. no help in the middle, unfortunately. MC possessing, possessing. Falls, falls to an MC player. Okay. Just no fouls, guys. Yeah, no fouls right there, please. Yeah. Nice turn by MC right there to try to keep it in Cabral. Cabral stays on it. She's going to send Glavin. Goes wide. Continues it. Ball stays in. Oh, now no. it's out. Okay. It appeared to be into me. I mean, it's got to be 100% over the line, but yep. the referee was right there. All 
right. I'm not sure what's happening here. A little pause. Oh, what's up? There you go. Goulding steps in front. I'm taking my Shriner. Shriner creates some space. Played out wide, MC pursuing. Ooh. Oh. The ball looks no uh, call. No call. It was a little shoulder ball shoulder. Still alive. Both playing yep. the ball. Look. Based upon the crowd reaction in front of us here, they thought of something more to that. Yeah. Well, I mean, anytime you see a big collision like that. Yeah. We'll... Played by Chloe Ellis upfield. Out of bounds. And it is a Belmont throw. Ball released out to the middle. Chloe Ellis with the turn. Plays it to the middle mm -hmm. to Glavin. Glavin with another turn, plays it upfield. She She's looks, offsides. She appeared to be offsides. Yeah, and it looks she like is. if she touches it, she will get the offsides call. And there she it is. is. There it is. That arm came up. Yep. He's just waiting for her to play the ball. And she was a good. She's off by a good two steps. Yeah. Again, that high, uh, high line from. It's MC. working. It is working. <laughs> Belmont doesn't seem to be able to adjust. That's when your midfielders stop making the run, by the way. Yeah. That's when you start letting heavy midfielders make a run and have them play it through to a midfielder going full speed. Yeah. That's what you do. And it's so it's almost like you got to you know, stop playing everybody so high, stop dropping some people back. A kind of a one-two play where a, hold, a holding forward gets it at the at the line itself, holds on to it, drops it back to a midfielder, and another mid midfielder makes the There's run. There's a push on the back. Looks like it's an MC kick. Yep. Uh, just over 21 minutes left here in the game. MC's keeping it close, 2 nothing. Most dangerous lead in sports. Yeah. <laughs> 2 nothing. that dreaded yeah. 2 nothing lead. Yep. 2-1's two yeah. a game. 2-1's a game, and 2-1 is a momentum yep. shift. Yep. And that's what that is, more than a game. MC, MC's looking, plays it in. Olivia Mann heads it. Oh, Chipped over. over, nice chip. Someone's got to want that. And someone's got to call, call for it. it. Yep. That's it. So quickly out. Nope, nope. There. Yeah. Okay. We Karayuki can... escapes. All right. Let's... Escapes. She had Golding uh, one level back uh, on that on that throw. And she chose to give it short and was intercepted. It doesn't always have to be a quick distribution. No. It doesn't. Um, you know? Just sits. Well, I think Coach Shemi was telling her to, to quickly distribute with her hands. Yep. Um, but up. she can get it out to the second level. If and if it's not there, hold it. Yeah, it's you know just be aware of those around you. And, yep. I, and you know when we it's, by the way it's a um, MC, MC corner. corner kick comes to the six yard oh. box drop back. No everybody one there. Up, everybody up on the defense. Yeah, guys. everybody was there. Yep. Played wide. Played in. A little deflection here. Some again Cabral. Spagnati, Spagnati, got to be quick here. She's, look, she's looking own, to make the pass, yeah. and she tries to squeeze it through and almost does. Yeah. Finds its way to the MC bench. Not a lot of movement for her there. She had a no. lot of space, but it's the person that you're not seeing that's going to close that down quickly, so you really got to decide what you're going to do with that ball. I'll, I'll play downfield. It'll be a man. Cable clears it out to Golding. Golding creates a little quick space, touch puts space. it down. A little bit heavy on yep. that touch there. Yep. Like to have seen her distribute that quicker. Ball played up to the middle. Nice pass. Up and and a nice tough ball. He needs to get there. Karaoke. Oh, that was okay, a nice now, play. For a moment. Take a second to look around before you distribute that. You yep. know, it's the same thing when you're playing on the field. You know, if you're if you're moving into a spot to receive a pass look take a quick second look around to see if there's anybody on your back anybody around to see what kind of space you have all right yeah. no okay. coach is going to get mad at you for not nope. taking a second to look you know nope. oh a little push big, to the back big there, push and, there and she got it yeah. so golden playing through it it's a, it's a, it's a kick spagnard going to take it oh no they're going to have cable come over Okay, the high line here is at the 35-yard line. Glavin and waiting to break. And the kick is from around the same, 35 yards from the other, uh, from the other side. Played it's low short. and hard. Shriner, Shriner turning it back towards the middle. Cable okay, moves into a passing lane and oh, gets and a little trip there and some other incidental contact on top of it all. Gets right up. Yeah. 
looking for her for getting right back up. Yeah, she's a rugby okay. star. Exactly. All right, so here we go. Here's, All right. Now, again, the 25-yard line is where the high line is being held. So, this, again, I think you jump, try to jump into the corner, which is exactly what he's doing, what she's doing here. And Goulding kind of chasing it onto it. Cuts the goal. Plays it across. Uh -huh. Oh, intercepted. Nice idea by, by Goulding there. Schreiner Here's plays a it smart back. Pass. Spagnardi. Smart. Oh, Spagnardi. Kind of try to get into the middle there, forcing it into yep. Glavin, but wasn't there on time, unfortunately. And looks like the coach wants a... Uh, looks like the ref wants to... Nope, there's a throw no. in here for MC. Okay. The ref was gesturing like he wanted to make some sort of change or call here. Play back to the goalie, Karika plays it wide. MC brings it down. Plays it back. Played by Glavin. Ball spins around, finds its way to Glavin's feet. I think she look at Nora going to the corner. Oh, Glavin <laughs> needed to release that. Yep, one, two, up. Back again, Glavin on the ball. Quickly again. Oh, yep. They collapse on her quickly. She Golding. seems enamored with her footwork right here. <laughs> but Who wouldn't be? Exactly. Anyway, up there and over, is. and here she comes. So uh, I think the goalie's MC goal is going to be getting yep. to that. But yep. Smiley to the knee, lets it come to her. And it's good for the defenders to see how hard the offensive people work. Oh, yeah. It's funny. It's one of those kind of things where often, especially when you play center back, the ball comes to you a lot more than you go to it. Yeah. You know? So, you know, so now you find yourself in the forward line where you find yourself going to it more than anything else and trying to find your way to get to it as opposed to, like, letting them come to you Carry and having the, the game punt. in front of you. Glavin did not go to that. Okay. Golden with a quick, easy touch. It's plays over. It up and it's over. over. And off to and the races on. and onside to Chloe Ellis. Chloe Ellis, what you can do here. Chloe, one quick touch. Glavin trailing. Up. Oh, keeps it, keeps it, cuts across. Schreiner and is way upside. In the corner. In the corner. Looks like Belmont's going to make a wholesale change here. Yeah, we got a 16 minutes and a half left. I think I'm Coach Jimmy. I think I want to see another goal. You yeah, know? I absolutely do. I want to see another goal. That's what I want to say. Uh, Cable with a kick. Fairhouse lone defender back. Really big Everybody crowd. in the box. Big crowd Everybody the in the box. box. And there's a nice. Uh, oh, on the outside again. Nothing seems to be finding its way with any kind of bend yeah. into the area. Yep. Yeah. Seems like it's going straight out of bounds. Yep. Yeah. Okay, quick MC sub here. Belmont currently has um, Sepian, Lair, Ramadas, Santos, and Hines warming up. Okay, MC with the kick. Goulding puts receives, it puts it on, Galavin on D. They just kick it out. Okay, Belmont throw. Spagnardi to take it. She's gonna, okay. uh, there you go. Plays it into Schreiner. Schreiner. shows though. Uh, oh, cannot unable keep it to him. handle it. I liked her breaking towards and being an option though. That was great. Uh, Give MC some credit for it. Yep. Two players collapse on it right away. Yep. MC throw, plays it to the middle. Finds its way to Spagnardi. Spagnardi's seen a lot of the ball. Good for her. Okay. Is Glavin holding it up. Finds a way past him. Bit of a bump there, but she finds a way through it. Schreiner to, to live. Olivia Mann finds it through to Chloe Ellis. Can she get a Can rip? Get it? Oh! Get it? Good, def well defended. Ooh, great opportunity, though. I like the effort. Ball dropping into play here. Olivia, Olivia Mann, Mann back on D. They kick it wide. Spagnardi. Spagnard and it's out. out of bounds for a Belmont throw. All right. Okay. So basically, we got Olivia coming off, Golden coming off, Olivia Man coming off. Excuse me. The Caputo's sisters are oh, coming like off. Chloe Ellis is coming off. Olivia yeah. Schreiner coming off. Great job, ladies. Ramanas is naughty. Two on, two players on her though, instantly. Belmont throw, not over the top. Spagnardi plays it quickly to Hines, tries to find a way to it, can't. To Farrah Harris, pursues that ball really well. Okay, Belmont throw. Belmont throw. It's interesting, the leaving Glavin up top. 
<laughs> it's interesting to see what comes from that. And yeah. there's a break. Cabral. Cabral looking just for a little a nice bit of help. Job. Just uh, yeah, looking for somebody to show. Yeah. Spagnati takes it, turns quick it over. Turn, quick turnover. Back on it though, and they're going to get a corner out of it. Yep. Giuseppe making the long run back to help out on defense. All right, uh, MC's got two people back. Glavin standing on the 50, everybody else in the box. MC's taking their sweet time. You get 12 yeah. minutes left in the game, you're down by two. I think he might have rushed through this. But ball Short. played low and hard. And goal kick. Goal kick. You think yeah. they'd be a little bit more, you know, pushed to the ball. And you think Belmont will be slowing it down. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, let's see what happens here. You can probably with the kick, it looks like. Plays it up to Santos. Uses her body to bring it down. Nice job. Yeah, it's a tough. To Ramadas. Ramadas to Hines. Glavin Hines already offsides. Already offsides. She's now she as long yeah. as as, as yeah. long as if, if I think that's great because again yeah. that cut through the middle, angular through ball yeah. is the what we need to be doing, and that's exactly what it was. I mean a little, maybe a little heavy anticipation from the Belmont forwards at that point in time, but I think you can see the effectiveness of it. Yep. It seems to be that like it seems to be working, you know, with this high line. Sarah, you have the throw. Nice Go throw. Lucy nice. Hines. Brings that down One, two, and Lucy sends Hines. it over. To Sepia. Everybody's on. Glavin breaking. Sepia, okay. Glavin's behind the ball here. Can she get it across to... She's got to get it from. Drop it to Dana Lair. Can Dana Lair one-time one it? And she can. Oh. And, oh, it's still Balls received. To Santos. Santos plays Santos. a one-two. Finds a way around the defender. Blocked and in And takes from the corner. She had Glavin right back there. Yeah. But I'll take the corner. Then I tell you, that MC center back is doing a really nice job back there. She's kind of broken up quite a few yeah. offensive runs by by Belmont. Number five. All right, Sarah, you to take the corner. Yeah. Harris back as a lone defender for Belmont. If anything, I would like to see a, a corner kind of be fall into a playable position. Yeah. Let's see. Nice. There it is. Perfect. There oh. and Santos almost gets a, gets a Cable foot on it. On Cable it. with the head on it. Bounces around for a wee bit. And that's going to come right out. Yeah. Cleared by MC. Farrah Harris back to collect. She's Spagnati on the outside. Spagnati, you got quick, quick touch. Looking for some help. Plays it downfield and to Santos. She's what? Off. Oh, yeah. She was yeah. off. Yeah. She was off. You know. She never came back on. Unfortunately, Spagnati had no other play. Yeah. No other play. That's poor Kalen. That was that was her only pass that she had, and she was getting <laughs> defended. All right, MC with kick. It's a nice ball. Downfield. Nice Farrah header. Farrah Harris. Farrah Harris. Falls, falls to Santos. Santos got Hines in the middle. Nice lead. Nice. And oh, nice step by the MC defender. Up, Up over the over. top. Yep. Spagnati chasing it down. MC. She's going to play for the oh, corner. She oh, she through. She finds it. And Kalen does bounce off her. Oh, drops it. And, and it's Gabriel clear clears. Gabriel. Yeah. All right, Kaylin is out. Ashley Waters coming in for her. Ah, it's good to see Kaylin out there. It is. Crowd and teammates give her a nice round of applause for some excellent work. And there's a shot from Noves across. Lair to come back to collect. Nice ball. Yeah, Lucy Hines. Lucy's got, Hines got some space. Got some space and a little bit of pace and on, a on trip, top of it all. But there it is. There it yeah. is. He made the right call from yeah. behind. Just eight and a half minutes quick, left. Put it, so. let, it's got to stop moving. It's got to stop moving before you kick it. Okay. And there it goes. Line being held around the 20. Up again, played towards the corners. Falls to Ramadas. Ramadas through to Glavin. Glavin and she will. Yeah, Glavin having a cup of yeah, coffee there. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, she was sitting there waiting for She's it. She's offsides by uh, a good three, four yards. Yeah. 
Much to her surprise. Much to her surprise, exactly. Uh, <laughs> Raph in the right place to make the call. Uh, nice play by Cabral. Ramadas takes a quick pass to Glavin. Glavin puts oh, it through. Lovely. Beautiful. Lovely. Off wide to Santos. Santos, get the little engine going. Plays it up. One, two. She's going to go take the shot. Uh, uh, gets blocked. Falls to Ashley Waters. Waters. Oh. Bumped off there. Bumped off. The yeah. Bumped off and played wide to an MC forward who plays it back to a defender. Ah, oh, can't keep it in. Ramadas quickly throws it down to Santos. And again, number five, you had to clean things up. Yeah. She's had a busy day. Yes, she has. Ashley Waters quickly into Ramadas. Ramadas looking back, back to, to Waters. Back to Ashley Waters. Where's the show? Where's the show? Yeah. And... A little deep there. Nobody on at yeah. the 18. Nice play by Dana Lair to pass nice that back. You. And looks like Lair and you have switched. Dana Lair's on the outside. Finds his way out of bounds. All right, Belmont, Belmont throw. Ball. About the 15 yard line. Little Sarah, little you to take it. A little seven minutes left. Falls into Lucy. Hines back to Sarah, you, who keeps it smartly. And yeah. That high line, they're running into their own their own players. They got to keep going. I think you're 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 exactly right. They're flat-footed as a result yep. of the high line because they can't do anything. Yep. That's why they either got to dribble through it or someone is going to make the run from behind you. If yep. You have the ball. Someone needs to start the run behind you, and you play it through. And that person's full speed. Ashley Waters chasing Ashley it down, Waters gets it their back. first nice easy play back to Harris. 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 Ooh, quick. Plays, plays it downfield to falls, Hines. Falls to Ramadas. Ramadas. And it's over. And Glavin's on. Nice. And she can do it. And, and she, oh, oh, she hits the post. <laughs> wow. Great effort. Great effort off wow. the post. A little bit unlucky there. Wow. A little bit unlucky. It's a more dinner time conversation for Frank and his daughter. <laughs> So, you know what? She was so wide open. <laughs> Watch to her surprise. She was onside, wide open. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, we go. top of the box. Well, Hines, Hines with the off header off the post. Ashley Waters with the goal. It's not. It's actually Lily Osepi. Lily Osepi with another goal. Sorry. Finds her way. It bounces off of her into the net. There it is. I, after uh, a post and a crossbar, I think you got to give it to Belmont, right? You know, that whole play started with the post. It did. It really, <laughs> it really did. It's just from the post. You know, so, so, so right now, 3 nothing Belmont with just over five left in the just game. Over five minutes left. I think your coach, Jimmy, okay, all right, you got the third goal. Yeah. That's now it's kind the of where you to, need to be, yep. you know. And it looks like Elizabeth Schreiner is going to be stepping into the game again. And, and Santos is going to take a break. And uh, actually, Hannah's out. Uh, Hannah's out now. That's what you she get. She had her opportunity. Yeah, that's what you get for hitting she the post. She had the shot. That's right. Yeah, that's what you get for hitting the post. You get to find your welding the bench. <laughs> and Coach Jimmy has a has a has a hug for her. <laughs> <laughs> well, <coughs> okay, MC maintaining possession, still playing through here. Falls to Ramadas. To Lucy Hines. Uh, Look of a Shriner. A little yeah. bit hard, but yeah, MC's goal like smothers. Play it out wide. She's trying to keep it in. And, and it unable to do so, out, yeah. so. Quick throw by Belmont. Layer to Sepian. There's Plays the break. The Shriner. Uh, nice play by the MC Ooh. goalie there. See how Shriner actually took a step back before she made the run. Yeah. I mean, so again, you're kind of start flatwood. You, you, you lose any momentum. You're taking a step back before you start your run forward. You know, it's kind of it's kind of productive, so to speak. You know, so falls to Harris. To Waters. To Waters does comes nice out job with playing through, through. through. She's got two options. And she plays it. Lays it Santos. in for Santos. There's the second defender. And well played. I, yep. I think Coach Jemmy was looking for a quick first time. There's a rip from Ashley Waters. Oh, up and over the net. Oh. Nice opportunity by Ashley shot. there. It's a great yeah. shot. Left foot, I think. Yeah, Get, getting back to Santos, I think Coach Jemmy wants to see that played across first time. Yeah. And I think um, that would probably be his one little discussion with her, discussion point at that point with her. 
Ball played out, falls to an MC player. Look like a handball, right? Mm, and it is. Okay, handball it is. Okay, careful to come take it up. Come to take it, I should say. Leaving two defenders back. She oh, takes a rip. Puts it on net. And yeah, smothered up by the makes it. MC goalie. You know, MC goalie's done a nice job not giving up any rebounds. Yep. She's smothering everything. Nice, nice distribution. Finds itself wide. Kept in bounds. MC ball. opportunity here for MC. Yep. Cable shuts it down, though. It falls back to Harris. Keeps it on that side. Ah, plays it out of bounds. Okay. Another sub for MC. Okay, we're in the referee's time, so to speak. Five minutes left. Ali Caputo in for Santos. Okay, Ashley Waters. This defense chips up. Yep. Number five again, in the middle of it. Yep, Ramanas. Looks. She could probably take this herself, and She's she does. Because everybody else and is offside. <laughs> yeah, everyone else is offside. Oh, and the save by the goalie. <laughs> you know what? Smart play. She took it because you know what? Again, yep. from, from the, coming from the midfield, full speed, make the run. Yep. Yeah, one's kind of standing still. Everybody right. was offside exactly. on the other side of her to begin with. Keep with it. Nice Cable waters. Coach Jemmy a little uh, beside. Can't, can't believe that uh, we missed that. Belmont maintains Water, possession. Ashley. I'm going to ask quick too. She's got a man on. That's a nice job. Leo Sepian trip. Trips from behind. No, no call, though. Oh, no, no there is a call. call. Okay. Is a call. So I didn't hear the whistle. It has to be a call. There, for sure. Okay. Not sure of the time at this point. Again, we're on referee's time. It's up over Bob, the top. Up over the top and played out by number five. A nice, nice. She's done a great job. Yep. Up. I'm going to ask up and over into the goalie's hands. Yep. Distributed with a throw. Waters is there and plays it out of bounds for an MC throw. MC sub. All right, Belmont off, throw. Off MC. Nice contact and defense by Ashley Waters on that. Okay, Lucy Hines. A little shoving match there. Comes nice up. Nice one-time pass. Belmont. Elizabeth Schreiner trying to play it through. The defender does a nice job defending that there. Tries to put it through. Defender's there first. Ali Caputo. Ali Caputo oh. chases it down, causes a turnover. Belmont throw. Waters into Ramadas. Quick drop played, didn't seem to work out. Finds its way upfield to MC, played out by Farrah Harris. Nice D. Throw in MC. Alec Caputo heads it out. Heads it out of bounds. Not too sure which referees are on the clock right now. Yeah, there's Alec Caputo with a nice defense again. Lucy Hines. Alec Caputo again. She's working. To Elizabeth Schreiner. Plays the ball down and around. Schreiner. To uh, Sepian. Yep. Sepian was, was yeah, it was offsides. Yeah. Okay, so it's free kick here. Belmont sets a line at 30. <laughs> now, 30. They're play, now they're playing their own high line. Exactly. Right? And Karaoke's way off the line, anticipating that ball through. Call and that it. is and the, that's game, the game, folks. That's the game. Well, Belmont three, uh, Malta Catholic zero, nil. Nil? You got to say nil again. I did. Yep. Uh, and uh, that's the end of the game here. Uh, good effort, I thought. Uh, on Belmont, it was nice. It looks like the kids had a lot of fun. I liked seeing Coach Jemmy put uh, uh, some players in different positions. Uh, I thought Malden Catholic, again, I think we've talked about this, very well coached team, did a really nice job. Never lost their composure, uh, played it consistently. Yep. 
Yeah, they, you know, they came in to play a Division One team, you know, and they're leaving the field with smiles, and you know, they should be proud of their effort. They did a nice job, you know, so so that's that should do it, folks. So, again. All right. Well, we'll see you next time. Yeah, Thanks Belmont, for joining. Belmont 3, Malden Catholic 0. Thanks. Talk to you soon.